Hi there, my name is Adam Tripp and today I'm going to take a look at an LED desk lamp from Taltronics. I'm a huge fan of LED technology and in my ongoing pursuit of changing every single light in the house that's not LED to LED for the energy saving benefits, um, I thought I'd take a look at another LED desk lamp. Now this one, I'll just... Um, try and get everything out the package. Ooh. That feels quite nice. Let's unsheathe it from this plastic jacket. Nice bit of weight in the base. This is metal. Some plastic, plas plastic on the base. Metal here and here. Can turn basically 90 degrees either way can go that high. So, you know, I've looked at LED desk lamps similar in the past and one of the issues was basically they weren't able to balance. This is all, I mean it feels obviously I'm, if I tap it I can unbalance it but as it is I mean you wouldn't have it like that really but um, it's nice to know it can go through its full range of motion, okay, and you've got 45 degrees with that bit. USB port in the back. And I complained with a, a previous light that the USB port was around here, it was right up on the side, and the power point, so it looked really clumsy with these cables coming down. This is much neater, you've got a USB cable really near the base and so that'll keep it nice and out of the way. You've got this touch, this touch kind of area for dimming the light and that's it on its brightest setting. So I'll just run low, high, low, high and that's it. Let's see, apparently, aha, aha, ah, well, that's cool. So just above the little brightness slider is a little icon, a little coffee mug and a reading book, which I'm guessing, you know, that, that goes through the, the color balance. So that's, so that's it at its most sort of orange and, and warm light. And then the next one will be the bluest, sort of, uh, you know, uh, the bluest light. There we go. I like the build quality. I like the silver and white. I think it looks, uh, it, it looks classy. It doesn't look cheap. It's, uh, which to be honest, looking at the picture, I was worried it might, but having felt the build, build quality and, uh, you know, it's actually a really nice, really nice lamp. I love this really quick ability to change the brightness, which uh, my other LED desk lamp that I bought, you have to tap. Well, you can tap or you can press and hold the button, whereas this, you can instantly go, you can tap the, the brightest or you can tap the lowest and, uh, and you can get from bright to low extremely quickly, uh, much quicker than my other lamp. And yeah, I'll, I like it, I like it. But this is not the best place to test it. This should be a bit better. Basically, I'm just in a room, I've set the camera up so it's on manual. I've, basically, you should see roughly what I can see. Obviously, it's not going to be exact, but it's not, reacting automatically. So as I change the light, you'll see the room brighten. Okay, let's switch it on. There we go. So after switching it on, it's gone to its halfway mark, which of course we can adjust using the little slidey um, touchpad bit. Uh, I'll put it up to full brightness. Okay, so that's us on full brightness and I'll just basically move it around and let you see the way that the, the light affects the room. And obviously we can swivel this bit. Okay, something that's uh, found quite interesting is if you want it to be really dim, you can just 
put it down like that and it does give off a decent amount of light and obviously you can dim it from there and so if it's really late at night because that's it on its lowest setting which is you know it's not bad but if you've woken up in the middle of the night and you really want minimal light you just want to be able to see what you're doing you can close that down and it really uh, you know blocks the main portion of light but just gives it enough to to let you see what you're doing but yeah that's it there that that's it's set on indoor balance lights so the sort of warmer yellow light and um, if I hit the the cut well, I'll put it up to full brightness first if I hit the color temperature button the, the little coffee mug to book icon there we go that's this is full daylight and the camera is white balanced to indoor light so this one will look really blue whereas if if you had this on during the daytime you know it wouldn't seem like such a, a stark difference between the the color of the light it does look quite blue here um, but obviously my eyes start to adjust to it the camera won't uh, because it's set um, and again I'll just run through the the brightness that's on lowest brightness on its um, on its daylight mode and yeah that's back on full brightness and once more just run around so I have to say um, actually I prefer it on it would go go through the cycle cycle through the color temperatures there we go that's it on the the most the most sort of orangey uh, nice indoor lighting um, I have to say I really like this light um, it's the build quality as I said earlier um, really impressed me I wasn't sure with it being white if it would you know be a wee bit cheap feeling but it's got these metal parts and yeah I mean it's got all this um, articulation and yeah it's perfect what can, what can I say uh, wrong about it it's um, not an expensive lamp and uh, yeah if you're looking for a multi dimming multi color temperature LED desk lamp with a USB socket then definitely check it out I'll put the link below